Phil Bile, owner of Bile Brothers Crane and Rigging. Today we're moving from Rockledge, Florida at the rail yard here. It had to come in by rail because it was so heavy. And we'll be taking it out across 520 across the St. Johns River Bridge. We are approximately just under 800,000 pounds, 20 feet wide, just under 18 feet high. Today we're moving from Rockledge, Florida at the rail yard here. It had to come in by rail because it was so heavy, but uh, we're going to be able to make all our turns and get right up in there to the switch yard. Six inches on the bunker. Easy. Come up a little drive. Easy, Craig. Easy, easy. Come up, Phil. I'll be keeping the back end straight and uh, pushing when need be. Oh, I'm watching the person on the rear of the trailer. They're going to help guide me around. And just like the one on the front of the trailer, they help guide. But other than that, it's just pushing and, and keeping the trailer straight. Ryder, you good all the way through where you are? Bring it up, Ryder. Bring it up, Nick. Bring it up. For this hump, bring it up a little. That looks pretty good. Basically what my job is to do is to stand on the back of the trailer, make sure it's level, and steer it as we go around turns. I got two remote controls that I will steer the trailer around each turn with. Once we get to where we're going down the straightaway again, we'll pin everything off and we'll continue down the road and let the trailer follow the truck. a turn we're just looking at a turning radius and always looking ahead making sure that there's no obstacles or anything that we can't see that's why we have several spotters and all our guys have radios one of our guys on the ground can let us know ahead of time before we get there because the trailer will only steer so fast basically everything's ran off of hydraulics and air and you basically hold a uh, valve down it releases a pin and then as the trailer's rolling you hold another lever and the hydraulics extend the rams in or out depending on if we're retracting or extending the axles the reason that we extend the axles is to spread the load weight out you don't want to have all the weight riding that close together
pyramid on. Lean it over. Anytime we make a turn, the trailer leans one way or the other. The sharper the turn, the harder the lean. We got to make sure that we keep everything level to a certain degree to make sure that the load doesn't shift or get unsafe. Looking good down the passenger side. Good, Nick. Looking good, Nick. Craig's going to be about three feet from the edge of the wall as he goes under. Looking good so far, looking good. Clearing the bridge by a foot. The officer said he's going to give us the whole uh, road until we get off, so if you need to move left or right, you're good. such a big trailer is we're spreading the load, dual laning it over several bridges, over the St. Johns River Bridge. Did this move probably 25 years ago with some dollies and today's new technology. We're using a big Trail King 800 to spread the load over the bridges. Backup power for all the homes and all in Brevard County. I appreciate all the citizens out here being patient with us when we make all the turns. But ultimately, this is going to give extra power to the community. So if you have anything heavy, long, wide, tall, don't hesitate to call Bile Brothers. It's 30 some years of experience. I have all my senior men on site to accommodate all your needs. All stop. 